Yo, what's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Motion Bring you guys another video. In today's video, I have some crazy, crazy news bringing you guys uh, the most hype beast skin in the game. I don't care what anyone says. It, it's a debate between this and the Galaxy skin, but honestly, this skin is probably more rare than Galaxy skin because this skin you cannot get anywhere. You can't get it unless you, I guess, buy it off of somebody off a third-party website or something like that, but it costs a lot of money for that. The Galaxy skin, you can still get it to, the, to this day. All you gotta do is just basically have money, but the other one is just a lot harder to get so guys with that being said guess what skin is coming to you guys probably can already tell i don't even got to say guess from the title and thumbnail that is right the skull trooper skin is coming back to fortnite battle royale at least at least we think it is it's probably like 90 percent verifiable fact that it is coming to fortnite battle royale now the reason this is is because if you guys don't know in the past we've been able to find out what skins were coming to fortnite due to leakers and stuff like that data miners finding codes in the game files and stuff like that just real nerdy stuff they end up finding files within the game and they find out what skins are being released that week or that month or something like that or what's happening basically in fortnite because the game the dev team the developers what they like to do is they like to put these files in the game a little bit early just so that way there's no bugs or anything like that and make sure everything runs smooth so that way when it's time to release it it releases smoothly and nothing's like buggy or anything like that so they actually ended up leaking some files or they found some files with the skull trooper skin coming back to the game now it's not just the skull trooper skin there's going to be i'll show you guys the tweet right now it says leak skull trooper set so there's a whole set of it this outfit what male skull trooper rarity epic glider which you're going to get a skull trooper glider you're going to get a skull trooper pickaxe and you're also going to get a back bling called the ghost portal now this makes sense because if you guys don't know back in season i think like maybe four it was when the when the rift in the sky or maybe it was last season season five where the rifts in the skies there's a big portal and stuff like that maybe this is like one of those little rifts on the back bling and it's the skull trooper coming back to the fortnite map through the rift from season five like he's coming back from another time zone you know what i'm saying like kind of like you know how the rift had people coming from different dimensions and stuff he's coming back from a different dimension with the rift as his backling which is pretty cool i definitely like the concept of it i i think it's pretty cool that they're bringing it back to the game now i know a lot of lot of people are mad people that own the skull trooper skin are probably furious with this because they're like yo what the heck why are they bringing it back like there's no reason for them to bring back this skin like they need to keep og skins og skins and Honestly, I kind of agree with you just because like it, it does like make the skins a lot more valuable It feels better to buy the skins when there's value to it rather than just making it open market for anyone But then again, it is what it is. You got to look at Fortnite as a company You know, they're out here trying to make money So the best way to make money is release the most hyped up skin and stuff like that kind of like Kanye West How we had Yeezys being limited release where you can only get them once they sold out they sold out but now he's changing it up to where the like the easy the cream 350 boosts were ended up released going crazy everywhere and the a endless amount of it basically so it's kind of like that where it's all about marketing where if the supply and the demand is there you gotta give the demand the supply basically something like that i don't know it's business talk and stuff like that but guys that's basically the truth it is coming out 90 percent sure i don't i don't think fortnite's ever released files in the game without releasing the actual item or something like that like at least skins or anything like that but guys with that being said guys if you please can give this video a thumbs up if we can get a thousand likes on this video i will do a free giveaway to anyone on this channel and guaranteed even if we don't hit a thousand likes on this video i'm doing a giveaway for the twitch prime sub members over on twitch so guys, whenever the skin releases, I will live stream and I will do a live stream giving away it. But you have to be a Twitch Prime member and you have to subscribe to the channel on Twitch. That's the only way. But if this video gets a thousand likes, I'll go ahead and do a giveaway to anybody for free. Um, it's just got to hit a thousand likes. So guys, with that being said, it's up to you if you guys want the skin for free. And I'll see you in the next video. Leave, leave, actually, leave down in the comments below. What do you think? Do you think it's bull crap that they're actually bringing the skin back? Or do you think it's a good idea that they're bringing this back? Because I want to know as a community what, what your guys' opinions are. Is it going to be worth it or is it going to be just nah, not worth it? Are you guys going to buy it? Is it a cop or is it a no just because it's hyped up and you're not a hype beast? Let me know down in the comment section below. But guys, thank you so much for all the love, all the support, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.